renowned for his unforgettable portrayal of Marshal Matt Dillon on the beloved television series Gunsmoke. The actor James Arnass experienced a rich and complex personal life. Born in 1923, Arnass's journey through marriage and family was as captivating as his career in Hollywood. Throughout his life, Arnass was married multiple times, each relationship shaping his legacy in its own unique way. His first marriage, which lasted for 15 years, resulted in the birth of two sons. Despite the eventual end of this union, Arnass remained committed to his role as a father, cherishing the bonds he shared with his children. Following his first divorce, Arnass found love again and remarried. This second union, which endured for over two decades, produced three sons, further expanding Arnass's loving family. Together, Arnass and his second wife built a life marked by loyalty and devotion, creating a warm and inviting home for their children. Even as his career continued to flourish, Arnass never lost sight of the importance of family. His close-knit clan, bound by love and shared experiences, stood as a testament to his commitment to the people who mattered most. The actor's personal life, filled with profound connections and enduring relationships, served as a compelling counterpoint to his iconic role on Gunsmoke. Delving into the marriages and family life of this celebrated actor offers a unique opportunity to explore the profound connections that shaped his legacy. In this examination, we discover the depth of Arnas's commitment to love, loyalty, and the bonds that held his family together through the decades. The story of James Arnas, both on and off the screen, is one of enduring relationships and the power of family. James Arnas, born James King Arnas, was a successful actor who found love with his childhood friend and eventual wife, Virginia Jenny Arnas. The two were raised in Minneapolis, and their shared love for outdoor activities sparked a romance that led to their marriage in 1950. Together, they had three children and chose to lead a private life away from the glitz and glamour of Hollywood. Despite his fame, the actor preferred to spend his free time with his family, enjoying the great outdoors. Their marriage lasted until Virginia's death in 1977, a testament to their strong bond and commitment to each other. Despite the challenges that come with a life in the spotlight, the actor and his wife managed to maintain a stable and loving relationship, far from the prying eyes of the public. Their story is a reminder that even the most successful and famous individuals have personal lives that are just as important as their professional accomplishments. The actor's career may have brought in fame and fortune, but it was his marriage to Virginia that truly defined his life. Jenny Arnass, born Virginia Chapman, started her career in acting and modeling in the 1940s and 1950s. She appeared in films such as The Farmer's Daughter and News for a Gunman. However, Jenny's career took a back seat as she focused on her role as a devoted wife and mother. She became the support system for her husband, the actor James Arnass, who was making a name for himself in Hollywood. Jenny's unwavering support allowed the actor to fully commit to his roles including his iconic portrayal of Marshall Matt Dillon in the classic television show Gunsmoke. Despite the glitz and glamour of Hollywood, Jenny chose to maintain a close-knit family life. She prioritized her role as a mother to her three children, ensuring they were well cared for and had a stable upbringing. Jenny's dedication to her family allowed the actor to focus on his career, secure in the knowledge that his loved ones were well taken care of. Jenny's focus on her family did not mean she abandoned her career entirely. She continued to act in smaller roles and appeared in a few of the actor's films. However, her primary focus remained on her family, and she was content to remain behind the scenes, supporting her husband and children. In conclusion, Jenny Arnes's career was marked by her dedication to her family and her unwavering support for her husband, the actor James Arnes. Despite her own success in acting and modeling, Jenny chose to prioritize her role as a devoted wife and mother, creating a stable, and loving home life for her family. Jenny Arnas, spouse of the well-known actor, James Arnas, faced a formidable battle against cancer. This devastating illness eventually claimed her life in 1977, when she was only 53 years old. The disease brought about significant challenges for Jenny and her loved ones, but the family remained a strong source of support during this trying time. The actor, known for his work in various films and the classic television show Gunsmoke, was deeply affected by Jenny's illness and her eventual passing. The children, too, experienced a profound sense of loss as they navigated life without their mother. Jenny's death left a significant void in the Arnas family, and they had to find ways to cope with their grief and move forward. Despite the pain of losing a loved one, they found solace in the memories they shared 
and the love that Jenny had brought into their lives. The family's strength and resilience during this difficult time were a testament to the bond they shared. They leaned on each other for support and found ways to honor Jenny's memory in their daily lives. As the actor continued his career, he carried the memory of his beloved Jenny with him, channeling his emotions into his work and creating a lasting legacy in the world of entertainment. The challenges that the Arness family faced during Jenny's illness and after her death only served to strengthen their bond and deepen their love for one another. After the death of his first wife, Jenny, in 1978, the actor James Arnas found love again with Janet Surtees. The two tied the knot in the same year and stayed together until their divorce in 1998. Their marriage was relatively private and they did not have any children together. James Arnas, who was best known for his role as Marshall Matt Dillon in the classic television show Gunsmoke, led a low-key life with Surtees. The couple preferred to stay out of the limelight and focused on their own interests. Arnas was an avid outdoorsman and enjoyed fishing and hunting, while Surtees had a passion for art and antiques. Despite their private lifestyle, Arnas and Surtees' marriage was a long and enduring one. They were together for over two decades, and their relationship was a testament to their mutual respect and admiration for each other. Sadly, James Arnas passed away in 2011, leaving behind a lasting legacy in the entertainment industry. His portrayal of Marshall Dillon in Gunsmoke remains one of the most iconic roles in television history, and his contributions to the world of film and television will always be cherished. Janet Surtees, who survived Arnas, continues to live a private life. She remains a beloved figure in the memories of those who knew and loved Arnas, and her presence in his life was a significant one. The love story of James Arnas and Janet Surtees is a reminder that even in the midst of loss and grief, new love can still bloom. Jenny Lee Arnas, the daughter of actor James Arnas, and his first wife, Jenny, lived a life that was largely kept out of the public eye. Unlike her father, who became a household name for his role in the classic Western television show Gunsmoke, Jenny's life was marked by personal struggles. Born in 1951, Jenny faced challenges that led her down a difficult path. She grappled with substance abuse, which ultimately had a tragic outcome. In 1975, just before her 25th birthday, Jenny's life was cut short due to a drug overdose. The impact of Jenny's death was profound, particularly on her father. James Arnas, who was known for his strong and stoic demeanor on screen, was deeply affected by the loss of his daughter. The tragedy was a painful reminder of the harsh realities that can impact even the most seemingly ordinary lives. Despite the challenges that Jenny faced, her memory lived on in the hearts of her family and loved ones. Her story serves as a reminder of the complexities that can exist behind the scenes, even in the lives of those who appear to have it all. The memory of Jenny Lee Arnas continues to resonate, a poignant reminder of the struggles that can impact even the most seemingly ordinary lives. In the vast landscape of Hollywood, James Arnas left an indelible mark as a towering figure in the world of television. Born on May 26, 1923, in Minneapolis, Minnesota, Arnas defied the odds and turned his dreams into reality. After serving in World War II, Arnas embarked on a journey to become an actor. His first major role came in 1955 when he was cast as Marshall Matt Dillon in the popular television series Gunsmoke. The show quickly became a hit, and Arnas's portrayal of the no-nonsense lawman resonated with audiences, making him a household name. Gunsmoke remained on the air for 20 seasons, a testament to Arnas's enduring appeal and the show's captivating storytelling. Throughout its run, Arnas appeared in over 600 episodes, making him one of the most recognizable faces on television. Arnas's impact transcended the small screen. He starred in several films, including the classic horror movie The Thing from Another World. His deep voice and imposing presence made him a natural fit for westerns and science fiction, and he continued to work in both genres throughout his career. Despite his success, Arnas remained humble and dedicated to his craft. He was known for his professionalism and kindness on set, earning him the respect and admiration of his peers. As we reflect on Arnas's life and career, we are reminded of the power of perseverance and the importance of staying true to oneself. Arnas's legacy continues to inspire aspiring actors and fans alike, leaving a captivating and enduring picture in the annals of Hollywood history. James Arnas, best known for his role as Marshall Matt Dillon in the classic TV show Gunsmoke, had a few key influences that shaped his path to acting. Born on May 26, 1923, in Minneapolis, Minnesota, 
Arnas was the son of a businessman and the youngest of four children. His family moved around quite a bit during his childhood due to his father's job, but they eventually settled in California. Arnas's height, standing at six feet seven inches tall, became a defining characteristic that opened doors for him in the entertainment industry. However, it was his brother, actor Peter Graves, who introduced him to the world of acting. Peter, already an established actor, encouraged James to pursue a career in the field. In 1945, Arnes served in the U.S. Army during World War II, where he was wounded in action. After his recovery, he followed his brother's advice and began taking acting classes. He studied at the Bliss Hayden School of Acting in Los Angeles, where he met his mentor, Jeff Corey, an accomplished character actor, an accomplished character actor, an acting coach. Corey became a significant influence on Arnas, helping him refine his skills and guiding him towards his breakthrough role in Gunsmoke. Arnes's early exposure to the craft of acting, combined with the support and guidance of his brother and mentor, paved the way for his successful career in Hollywood. His towering height and deep voice, along with his natural talent and dedication to his craft, made him a perfect fit for the iconic role of Marshall Matt Dillon. Growing up in Minneapolis, James Arnas, or Jimmy as he was known then, was an introverted child who found solace in the world of radio. He would spend hours listening to adventure stories, which sparked his imagination and fueled his passion for storytelling. However, it wasn't until a pivotal experience in his late teens that he discovered his love for acting. During World War II, Arnes served in the army and was injured in Anzio, Italy. While recovering in the hospital, he met a fellow patient who introduced him to the world of theater. Intrigued, Arnas began acting in hospital shows, which helped him cope with the pain and boredom of his recovery. He found that he had a natural talent for acting and a deep love for the craft. After the war, Arnas moved to California to pursue a career in acting. He struggled at first, working odd jobs and taking small roles in films and television shows. But his big break came in 1955 when he was cast as Marshall Matt Dillon in the popular TV series Gunsmoke. The show became an instant hit and Arnes became a household name. Arnes's portrayal of Marshall Dillon was groundbreaking as he brought a new level of realism and depth to the Western genre. He played the character with a quiet strength and dignity that resonated with audiences, and his performance helped to cement Gunsmoke's place in television history. Despite his success, Arnes remained humble and dedicated to his craft. He continued to act in films and television shows throughout his career, always striving to improve and challenge himself as an actor. His passion for storytelling, which began in his childhood, never waned, and he left behind a legacy that continues to inspire and entertain audiences today. James Arnas, a towering figure in Hollywood, faced numerous challenges on his path to stardom. Born on May 26, 1923, in Minneapolis, Minnesota, Arnas's journey was marked by financial struggles and industry skepticism. Raised during the Great Depression, Arnas experienced hardship early on. Yet, these circumstances fueled his determination to build a better life. After serving in World War II, Arnas turned to acting, a decision met with skepticism due to his lack of experience and connections. Undeterred, Arnas persevered. He enrolled in acting classes, honing his craft and building a network of industry professionals. However, work was scarce, and Arnas often found himself struggling to make ends meet. In a creative solution to his financial woes, Arnas took on various jobs, including construction work and painting houses. These experiences not only provided a steady income, but also offered valuable insights into human nature, which Arnes would later incorporate into his acting. Despite the obstacles, Arnes's resilience and determination paid off. In 1955, he was cast as Marshall Matt Dillon in the long-running television series Gunsmoke, a role that would catapult him to stardom and solidify his place in Hollywood history. Through hard work, determination, and a little bit of creativity, James Arnas overcame the challenges of his early career, leaving a lasting impact on the world of television and entertainment. In 1955, James Arnas, a relatively unknown actor, landed the role of a lifetime. He was cast as Marshall Matt Dillon in the new TV series Gunsmoke. This groundbreaking project would become the longest-running Western in television history, airing for 20 seasons. Arnas' portrayal of Dylan was a turning point in his career. His imposing height and stoic demeanor made him the perfect fit for the role. Critics and audiences alike were captivated by his performance. As one critic put it, Arnas brought a quiet strength and dignity to the character, making Matt Dillon one of the most iconic figures in TV history. 
The success of Gunsmoke catapulted Arnaz to stardom and solidified his place in the annals of television history. His impact on the Western genre cannot be overstated. He proved that a Western could be more than just shootouts and saloon brawls. It could also explore complex themes and nuanced characters. Despite his success on Gunsmoke, Arnas never became typecast. He continued to take on diverse roles in film and television, including the lead in the 1957 sci-fi classic, The Thing from Another World. His ability to transition seamlessly between genres was a testament to his versatility as an actor. Throughout his career, Arnas remained humble and grounded. He never forgot his roots or the fans who made his success possible. As one of his collaborators said, James was a true professional and a genuine person. He always treated everyone with respect and kindness. That's why he was so beloved by his peers and fans alike. In the end, James Arnaz's legacy is one of enduring impact and lasting influence. His breakthrough moments in Gunsmoke and The Thing from Another World resonate to this day, inspiring new generations of actors and filmmakers. His contributions to the world of television and film are cherished, and his name will forever be etched in the annals of Hollywood history. James Arnaz, known for his role as Marshal Matt Dillon in Gunsmoke, had a unique approach to acting. He was known for his quiet intensity and understated style. Arnes once said, I never went in for the big scene. I think it's more effective to underplay. This approach allowed him to create a believable and relatable character that resonated with audiences. Arnes's personal experiences and worldview were also reflected in his work. Growing up during the Great Depression, he developed a strong sense of justice and a commitment to hard work. These values were embodied in his portrayal of Marshall Dillon, who was known for his unwavering dedication to protecting the citizens of Dive City. Arnas's artistic vision was also shaped by his experiences as a veteran of World War II. He served in the Army during the war and was awarded a Purple Heart for his service. These experiences gave him a deep appreciation for the sacrifices made by soldiers and a commitment to telling stories that honored their service. In addition to his work on Gunsmoke, Arnas also appeared in a number of films and television shows including The Thing from Another World and How the West Was Won. Despite the variety of roles he played, he remained true to his understated style and commitment to authenticity. Arnes's legacy as an actor is marked by his ability to create complex and relatable characters, his dedication to his craft, and his commitment to telling stories that matter. His work continues to resonate with audiences today, serving as a testament to his enduring talent and impact on the world of television and film. James Arnaz, best known for his role as Marshal Matt Dillon in Gunsmoke, made a significant impact on the Western genre and the television industry as a whole. His portrayal of a tough, yet compassionate lawman resonated with audiences and helped to establish the Western as a popular and enduring genre. According to Robert Thompson, a professor of television and popular culture at Syracuse University, Gunsmoke was the first successful adult Western and it really set the template for all the westerns that followed. Arnes's performance was central to the show's success, and his influence can still be seen in westerns and other genres today. Arnes's imposing physical presence and stoic demeanor became the standard for western heroes, and his portrayal of Marshall Dillon helped to define the archetype of the strong, silent type. His impact can be seen in the work of actors such as Clint Eastwood, who has cited Arnes as an influence and has even credited him with helping to launch his career. In addition to his influence on actors and the Western genre, Arnas also helped to shape the techniques and storytelling of television. Gunsmoke was one of the first shows to use location shooting and natural lighting, which added a sense of realism and grit to the show. The show also tackled complex and mature themes, which was unusual for the time, and helped to set a new standard for television storytelling. Arnes's contribution to the industry is still celebrated today, and his influence can be seen in the work of contemporary actors and filmmakers. As Thompson notes, James Arnes was a true pioneer, and his impact on the Western genre and television as a whole cannot be overstated. In conclusion, James Arnes's contribution to the television industry and the Western genre is undeniable. His portrayal of Marshall Matt Dillon in Gunsmoke helped to establish the Western as a popular and enduring genre and his influence can still be seen in the work of actors and filmmakers today. Arnas's impact on storytelling and techniques of television is also significant, as he helped to set new standards for realism and mature themes in television. James Arnas, best known for his role as Marshall Matt Dillon on the long-running television show Gunsmoke, 
had a life outside of the spotlight that was deeply informed by his personal values and interests. Born on May 26, 1923, in Minneapolis, Minnesota, Arnas was the son of a businessman and a journalist. He served in World War II, where he was wounded in action and received a Purple Heart. After the war, he attended college on the GI Bill and began his acting career in the early 1950s. Arnas was a private person who valued his family and friends above all else. He was married twice and had three children. In his free time, he enjoyed fishing, hunting, and spending time outdoors. He was also an avid reader and had a deep appreciation for literature. Despite his success as an actor, Arnes remained humble and down to earth. He was known for his kindness and generosity, and he often went out of his way to help others. He was also a strong supporter of various charitable causes, including the Disabled American Veterans Organization and the National Multiple Sclerosis Society. Arnes's personal values and interests often informed his work as an actor. He was drawn to roles that allowed him to explore the complexities of the human experience, and he was known for his nuanced and compelling performances. He believed that acting was a way to connect with others and to shed light on the human condition. One of Arnes's most notable philanthropic efforts was his support for the Motion Picture and Television Fund, a nonprofit organization that provides financial assistance and services to members of the entertainment industry. Arnes was a longtime supporter of the fund and served on its board of directors for many years. In addition to his work as an actor and philanthropist, Arnes was also a dedicated environmentalist. He was a strong advocate for conservation efforts and worked tirelessly to protect the natural resources of his beloved home state of California. In conclusion, James Arnas was a man of many talents and interests, but he was perhaps best known for his kindness, generosity, and commitment to making the world a better place. His personal values and passions informed every aspect of his life, from his work as an actor to his philanthropic efforts and environmental activism. He will be remembered not only for his impressive body of work, but also for the positive impact he had on the lives of those around him. Reflecting on James Arness's legacy, it's clear his work as a legendary actor has left an enduring mark on the industry. Starring in classic shows like Gunsmoke, Arnas brought depth and authenticity to his roles, captivating audiences for generations. His career serves as a testament to the power of dedication, hard work, and staying true to one's craft. For aspiring professionals, Arnas's advice would be to remain passionate and committed to your goals. The path to success is often filled with challenges, but perseverance and a strong work ethic can help you overcome obstacles. Additionally, never underestimate the importance of humility and treating others with kindness and respect. As for the future, Arnas would likely encourage aspiring professionals to embrace innovation and new technologies, while always staying grounded in the core principles of their craft. By doing so, they can help shape the future of their industry and leave a lasting legacy for generations to come. In short, James Arnas's legacy serves as a shining example of what can be achieved through hard work, dedication, and a commitment to excellence. Aspiring professionals would do well to follow in his footsteps and strive to make their own mark on the world. James Arnas, a towering figure in the entertainment industry, stood at an impressive 6'7". Born on May 26, 1923, in Minneapolis, Minnesota, Arnas embarked on a journey that would cement his place in television history. After serving in World War II, Arnas found himself in Hollywood, where he initially struggled to find work. However, his persistence paid off when he was cast in the iconic role of Marshall Matt Dillon in the long-running television series Gunsmoke. This role, which he played from 1955 to 1975, showcased Arnas's passion for acting and his ability to embody complex characters. Arnas's impact on the Western genre cannot be overstated. His portrayal of Marshall Dillon was groundbreaking as he brought a sense of realism and depth to the character that had not been seen before. This innovation helped to elevate the Western genre and pave the way for future shows and films. Beyond Gunsmoke, Arnes appeared in numerous other television shows and films, including The Thing from Another World and How the West Was Won. He continued to work in the industry until his retirement in 2001, leaving behind a legacy that continues to resonate with audiences today. Arnes's journey is a testament to the power of creativity and perseverance. Despite facing initial challenges and setbacks, he remained dedicated to his craft and left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. His enduring impact serves as a reminder that with hard work 
and passion, anyone can make their mark and leave a legacy that will be remembered for generations to come. As we take a moment to appreciate the work of James Arnass, let's reflect on his impressive career. Arnass, who was born on May 26, 1923, is best known for his role as Marshal Matt Dillon in the popular television series Gunsmoke. Throughout his career, Arnass demonstrated his talent as a skilled actor, captivating audiences with his commanding presence and distinctive voice. His work in Gunsmoke spanned an incredible 20 years, earning him a place in television history as one of the longest-running primetime characters. Beyond Gunsmoke, Arnass appeared in a variety of film and television roles, showcasing his versatility as a performer. From westerns to science fiction, he left his mark on many genres and earned the admiration of fans and industry professionals alike. Now, we invite you to share your thoughts on James Arness's work and legacy in the comments below. What are your favorite memories of watching him on screen? How did his performances impact you? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content celebrating the creative spirits who have shaped the entertainment industry. Let's keep the conversation going and honor the lasting impact of James Arness. Together, we can appreciate the tapestry of talent he helped weave in the world of entertainment.